Welcome back here to WTXL Sunrise. Ooh, does that not look oh so good? If you weren't hungry already, it's summertime. What better way to celebrate than with some watermelon really kicking things into the spirit of the summer? Here with us now is Melanie Mays, the executive director of the Jefferson County Chamber of Commerce and Watermelon Festival Chair. Yeah, this is a big event. You guys are going to be slicing up and dishing out a whole lot of well oh, watermelon this we week. Do, we do every year. It's a time-honored event. This is our 64th annual wow. Jefferson County Watermelon Festival. And of course, Kelly's in the competition. Not really, <laughs> but watermelon queen, you know, but she she is thinking about the, uh, the seed spitting competition. I'm telling you, I would lose I would just be I'd just be last place so yeah. other people can show me maybe there you go. The, the key all right well we do have a new watermelon queen we've already had the pageants and so uh, our new watermelon queen is Caroline Yawn and she's very excited and I'm sure she will serve us well <laughs> and, and, and speaking of serving I mean really this is yeah. gonna be a whole lot of fun oh, coming absolutely. up this weekend and a lot of fun for the whole family absolutely there's so much to do um, the event we've had small events every day little lunches with music mm -hmm. uh, Thursday we have the women's club lunch and fashion show then Friday is really where we start all of the events with the vendors loading in um, uh, about five o'clock there's going to be a rotary barbecue mm -hmm. uh, then we go into the seed spitting contest we have children's theater 2014 mm. space oddity at the opera house and it is odd it's a lot of fun <laughs> uh, and then we have the street dance featuring mm -hmm. Bobby Kennedy and his groups and, and is there something too about ghost tours oh I was yes hearing? ghost tours absolutely we have ghost tours both Friday and Saturday night at 8 p.m. those start from the chamber and that's the historic Monticello ghost tours um, Betty Davis is the guide for that's her nonprofit and it's it's a wonderful thing people have a lot of fun with that and with some of the ghost tours, a lot of history oh, mm -hmm, in the yeah. Monticello area with Absolutely. that. So that's going to be fun. And yeah. you know, speaking of history, mm -hmm. for those who may not know, watermelon, right. big connection with, with Jefferson County. Well, it, it used to be our number one um, product, our number mm -hmm. one export. Um, that is no longer the case. At one time, I was told there were around 500 growers. I'm not sure it was quite that many. Mm -hmm. But over the years, other places, I think climates have changed. I think um, it takes a lot of land to grow watermelons. And I just think it's changed. You know, we probably probably export more pecans now. Right. Uh, it, we used to be the center for tongue oil, so there are other things, you know, even cotton, things like that. We're a big farming community, mm -hmm. big ranching community, actually. So. And, and this is really, but yeah. still paying tribute to mm -hmm. something that was really very important in the foundation of Jefferson County. Uh, yeah, absolutely. And so, you know, I mean, uh, uh, I think a lot of fortunes were made with watermelons, <laughs> mm -hmm. and, and uh, but now we just, we, we continue to celebrate it, I think, because we're just stubborn, and we just enjoy <laughs> being out in the heat and all that. And, and a very special <laughs> Special kickoff to summer, though. People, exactly. I'm sure, have circled exactly. this date on their exactly. calendar. They know this is maybe, well, yeah. especially it's on June 21st. That's June usually 21st, right? The Friday night kind of anyway. kinda kicks it off, and then we go into Saturday, which is the main day with the parade and the vendors and the ex art exhibit and the car show, mm -hmm. and once again, the children's show. And we have a BMX bike exhibition this year, which is a really fun trick riding. And so free I'll, entry. So even better. Free entry. Ah, it's great. <laughs> so, so, really, what we're trying to say is, there is nothing not happening exactly. in Jefferson <laughs> County this weekend. That's true. June 24th, we've got all the details up on our Sunrise section, WTXL.TV. Okay. Melanie Mays, thank you very much thank for joining so us much. here. Thank you so much. So good to see you. This morning, our pleasure. <laughs>